closed. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. <coughs> what do you want? How about we start with a light? Well, you gotta name this? Elizabeth. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl. This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, the girl's dead. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get- Lost it. isn't dead. Name your radar, I will pay you for this work. You'd do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know. But I know someone who does. Follow me. We don't scare of our own shadow. I'm the independent type. And that's why I salute What's this girl to you? What I need from her is my business. But I know where to start looking. Something tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. What happened to these children? What are they? Where have you been? A cabin in Arcadia? Green Little sisters. Atom factories. It's grotesque. No. Compromise? Is that why we came to Rapture? You're not knowing about the little sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture, I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Where are we headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken, down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? A cop friend of mine, Sullivan, says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking you to one of them. <laughs> Mr. DeWitt, you all right? I'm fine. Just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. Refreshment, sir. Madam? We're fine, thanks. I went through basic with the decency. I told her, you want someone to listen to your worries? Buy a poppy with me. Mr. DeWitt, we'll find my source inside of that club. Cohen? What does that lunatic have to do with Sally? Private party. No entry without invitation. We'll see about that. Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, 
Business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected... No mask, no entry. Stuffed shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of, they must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is business. It says it's sponsored by the artist struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. What brought you to Rapture? A man. Really? You don't strike me as the romantic type. Wasn't that kind of man. Then what? There's a debt that needs repaying. I've known my share of Shylocks. You're no Shylock. Wasn't that kind of debt. Invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted. Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure out a way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just find the mask. Leave the distractions to me. Good day to you, ma'am. Excuse me. Lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, excellent. You've an eye, haven't you, miss? It's a natural sapphire and diamond, 18 karat gold ring, fully hallmarked for Paris, 1887. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. I beg your pardon? Right out of her coffin in Twilight Fields. Did you think we wouldn't notice? <laughs> I can Cohen sure. sends those masks the out in some kind of, of box. The robber are of no interest to me. If you hand the ring back, the matter yeah, will remain between you and Must be somewhere else. Me. Hmm. Might be best if we were gone when he wakes up. Any luck? Nothing. Let's find another shop. Where should we look next? Upstairs at the artist's struggle or Rapture Records straight ahead? You see that dish I walked in with? Will you give her the star treatment, pal? That'll make it worth your while. Of course, right away. It's by Trinet, but of course, covered by Mr. Reinhardt. Oh, it's lovely. Gotta find Isn't that box. Lovely? Nothing. Well, only one place Our left. Music does something to me. I must go. I must go. Even one more note shall prove my undoing. Frank Fontaine. Nothing? No. Got one place left, though. And if that proves to be fruitless? We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. All that unpleasantness. Hey, pal. You want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. Interesting, isn't it? An original Sander Cohen. He calls it Miasma. I'm sorry, but... I I know precious There's little about art. That box. How does it make you feel? I have to open my mouth. There you are, you little bitch. Might tumble out. Would you like me to tell you what? You have given me so much to think about. I, I feel a trifle swoony. W would you mind if if I return tomorrow for further education? I shall be here at your service. Amazing what a few months peace and quiet. Located the mask. Third time's a charm. All right. It's best we head back to Cohen's. Ryan understands something. I'm not looking at Fine piece of work back with those shopkeeps. You've got a bit of the grifter in it. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Ah, very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. So who is this fellow Cohen? Some sort of underworld figure? Worse. He's an artist. An artist who kidnaps children. Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen this type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. Open yourselves to the music! 
music to the spirit of the eternal. No. Why do you fail in this fashion? To embarrass me in front of my muse? My muse shall not be mocked. Fitzpatrick! Please! The stick! And who for God's sake! <laughs> my muse shall not be mocked! Get them out of here! There shall be no failure on my canvas. <laughs> There's no room in rapture anymore. Who are you? Name's DeWitt. Is that right? My... <laughs> this one's a real biscuit. Isn't he a biscuit, lady? I need to ask you a few questions. Questions? Yes. Yes. It is the work of man to ask. It is the work of the artist to answer. You've seen this girl, haven't you? We artists see more than most. You are more than you claim to be, little songbird. Are you not? Watch this one, DeWitt. She'll take you where you don't want to go. But I know the child in that photo is important to you. So many children flit, flit, flit away. I know where the girl is. And I will send you to her in exchange. All I ask is a dance. What? I see something in you, too. Art strips away artifice. Show me who you are, and I will show you where you need to go. Cold son of a bitch. Mr. DeWitt. What? Dance with me. Come, come, dance! I shudder to think what greater price he might care to extract. Fitzpatrick! Beauty and pain. They can be no more separated than birth and blood. What do you think Cohen's customers do with the children? Do they? Sometimes. But those types like the capital of people like Ryan and Sucho. That's a blessing. You saw those little sisters? You so sure? But if Su Chong had Sally, I'd know it. How? As I tied him to a chair and asked him. So? For 15 hours. I don't know what to make of you, Mr. DeWitt. No, 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 no! Listen, we're not gonna keep- Fitzpatrick! Ah! I see suffering in you. I know how to shine a light on your pain. A more. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt. Are you all right? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought... Pain and beauty. To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I am sending you to find your young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. Look. Fontaine's. Ryan sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. You'll find your little bird in the housewares department. 
How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. All right, there's a dock up ahead. Takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. No, what's that? Burial, let's see. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. Too comfortable. Keep your eyes open. You won't have to. Stand your ground. It's every man's right. Seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. DeWitt. It's Booker. What? Just call me Booker. If it's all the same to you, let's leave it at Mr. DeWitt. <sighs> Look up there. Let's have another look around. Perhaps we'll be able to find something to get us up and over. Could be handy. A skyhook? Skyhook? You mean the air grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the pneumo lines. Air grabber? Huh. Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never mind. Stuck. Mr. DeWitt, someone's no, coming. No, no. Come back. I want the uh, let's work something out. All right, I got the grabber unjammed. <laughs> Can't hear myself. Ah! Mr. DeWitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming it still works. Optimism, Mr. DeWitt. It helps in situations like this. Nico time. I make my own decisions. Nico time. When did you come to Rapture? Oh, it was, uh... Jeez, I guess around... 51? No. 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before. Sort of becomes a blur. 49. 49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. Here, little birdies. Eat it up. But it, it's good for you, you know? I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. What, what's, what's the matter with you? Do, do you think it's poison? Mr. DeWitt, look. Well, there's the tram. That splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. An ice rink. Be good at places any to look for our new friend. It says it's on the top floor. So we go up. Damn thing's locked. Let me see that. Oh, have matters progressed so little? I could turn this with a rake pick. Done. Where'd you learn that? Oh, it's something I picked up a long time ago. Our frozen friend leaves a hell of a trail. Come on. Just let me in, okay? Slicers. Uh, Fontaine? He said we're all equal down here now. We're all in the same boat. I just want to... Elizabeth, a little help? I'll see what I... Mr. DeWitt. The plasmid? Have you forgotten what we came for? Damn it, the 
that son of a bitch drank every last bottle of Old Man Winter. I think I can help. <laughs> oh. What was that? It's a, uh, new plasmid. Let's me... Let's me bring in things that might exist, but, uh, don't. I'm not sure I understand. What's it called? Tear. Where'd you find that? You don't expect a girl to share all her secrets, do you, Mr. DeWitt? Freeze your enemies. Shatter them into a thousand pieces. Sally's not your daughter. What's she to you? Why risk life and limb? She's part of the job. You owe me no explanation. She's just another orphan. After Fontaine went down, city was lousy with her. And? I don't know. You have a reason for every stupid thing you've ever done? She started showing up, looking peaked. More... Uh, hang on a sec. I want to take another look around. How did you lose her? It's none of your business. Something about you. Doesn't sit right. Yes? Wouldn't peg you as the rapture type. Not even a little. If you mean I have no interest in joining the Andrew Ryan book club, you'd be right. Just another set of fanatics with a different set of books. I gamble. What? You asked me how I lost Sally. I gamble. Took her somewhere a kid's got no business being. I was winning. In a place like that, you don't let a kid out of your sight. But you did. Yeah, and here we are. But the million dollar question is, what's she to you? I have an interest in reuniting you with her. Isn't that reason enough? Let's hope Cohen was on the level when he said this is where we'd find Sally. I can only imagine what they would do with a child in a place like this. Cohen's halfway to Splicetown. Probably thought putting a child in prison would be high art. The sooner we find her, the better. Come on out of here! Yeah. Oh. What are you doing? This is a schematic for the venting system. It shows there are more vents like this one in electronics, the bistro, returns, the book department, and the appliance show floor. So? If she's in there, there are only six vents she can come out of. Now there are five. All these vents are connected to the central heating unit. If we close them off and turn the heat up, she'll be forced out through the central exhaust. It's the only exit. You want to burn her alive? No, we just make it hot enough to flush her out. You can't do that. Look, either we find her, or one of those splicers will. <sighs> All right. Where are the other vents? Up ahead. Come on, love. Oh, Mickey just wants to give you a little squeeze. <laughs> You don't want to disappoint your old uncle now, do ya? There's another vent. Close it. Two down. Where to now? Halfway there. I tried so hard to reduce to Okay, next one. Sally? Sally, it's me, Booker. Now, you come out now. S Sally? Dear, do, do you hear me? It's, it's me, Booker. 
Now listen, dear. You come out right now! Mr. DeWitch, she's not coming. Now let's get the rest of these vents sealed. It's the only way. It's the last one. Where's the exhaust? In the toy department. No sign of her. Looks like we'll need to turn up the thermostat if we're gonna flush her out. It's over that way. The thermostat's right there. Turn the heat up. I'm not going to burn her. It's the only way to bring her to us. If you won't do it, I will. Just give me the word. Turn it up. What? Turn the goddamn thermostat up. Do you hear that? We need to get back to the exhaust before we lose the girl again. Sally! Sally, come out! It isn't working. I told you she's coming. It isn't working. Turn if it off. Turn it off. It's not going to work. We have to turn it off. We are hurting her. <laughs> Sally! <laughs> Sally? Sally, it's Booker. It's me. Sally, come on. I'm going to get you out of here. <laughs> Sally! Come out here right now. No. Mr. DeWitt, the girl! Sally! It's okay, Sally. Is she? Look, look at Sarah. Huh? She, she, she's come to see you. We're going home. Do you want to go home? Don't fight, please. Don't. I'm here. I just want to take you home. I just want to. Get her back. Get her back. You're hurting her. She's got to come with she's me. She's not your child. She is mine. Let her go. Let her go. She's mine. The door is closing. Shut it down. Shut down the machine! You've got to pull her through! Pull. Shut down the machine! No, she's not through! Pull. Shut it down! wasn't yours, Comstock. No, no, no. I wasn't. No, no, no. Yet you had to have me, didn't you? No, this isn't right. And when the guilt no. was too much... You turned to us to solve your problem. To provide a place to go where you might forget. Where there never was an Anna in the first place. Comstock was never one to own up to his errors, was he, brother? Never comfortable with the choices he made. Always seeking someone else's life to claim as his own. Elizabeth. Child. I am so sorry. No, you're not. You're about to be. They told me, son, you were born to do great things. They were right. I'm Atlas, and I aim to keep you alive. You think that?
That's a child down there. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a monster. It's Ryan! Goddamn Andrew Ryan! Head to medical! Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly find Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly head to Ryan's office and kill the son of a bitch? Did that airplane crash? Or was it hijacked? gave them the one thing that was stolen from them. A chance. Sally! Sally, come out! She wasn't yours, Comstock. Elizabeth, I am so sorry. No, you're not. But you're about to be. Yes. Quel est votre nom? Elizabeth. Pour vous, Elizabeth. Oh no, no, I, I, I couldn't. I, I can't accept. Je vous en prie, j'insiste. Oh, thank you. Bonjour, Monsieur Sir. Ah, bonjour, Mademoiselle Elizabeth. Je manque d'inspiration aujourd'hui. Bonjour, Elisabeth. Bien, bonjour. Bonjour, mon ami. Alors, tu as parlé à la jolie petite américaine Oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. Bonne journée. Comment ça va, Elisabeth Bonne journée. Elle est tellement... Pas les deux. Sally? Sally! Come back! Wait! Come back! Come back! Wait! Sally, stop! Come back! <laughs> Sally, where are you going? Come back! Sally, hold on! Come back! Stop! Where did she go? Anything! No, 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 
No! It wasn't my fault. Leave me alone! Can't you just leave me alone? I'm sorry! I'm sorry. I never should have left. I never should have left you there. Empty. Empty again. What are the odds? What's the hold-up? Just having a bit of a laugh, Atlas. This ain't a sporting event. Put a bullet in her. No need to torture the poor girl. We're not animals, you know. All right, all right. Let her go! Quiet down, dear. In a minute, all your problems will be over. Elizabeth, tell him you can get him back. Parker? I can get you. How? Say I can get you back to Rapture. What? Just say it. I can get you back to Rapture. Put the gun down. Now, what was that you said about Rapture? I can get you back to Rapture. And how you plan on doing that, sister? You some kind of magician? Su Chong. What? Tell him Su Chong. Su Chong. And how do you know that slant-eyed wonder? You're his lab assistant. I'm his lab assistant. If it escaped your notice, Andrew Ryan sunk us 5,000 fathoms below his shining city. How does Su Chong propose to get us back? That's between me. That's between me. And the slant. And the slant. But if I do this, the girl goes with me. Little sisters are worth their weight in gold. She's not up for negotiation. Last time I checked, Back in the city, they were making little sisters by the dozen. That's a right fairy tale you've dreamed up, sister. But if you're lying, we can just as well kill you tomorrow. Down here, we got nothing but time. In case I need to get hold of you. If you see Su Chong, tell him. Atlas says he hasn't forgotten him. I didn't kidnap her. Uh, but she made for some exceptional bait, didn't she? Had to be done. Did it? I felt everything that every version of me felt. All of that knowledge. I lost a pinky. But that version of me, she lost everything. In Comstock. That final Comstock, he thought he could avoid his guilt by coming here. You educated him proper. But then why am I back here? Huh? I don't remember opening a tear to come back. And who are you? Huh? I think you'll figure that out soon enough. Paris. I, I was happy. And now I'm here dealing with this Atlas, this, this psychopath. What was I thinking? I wasn't Paris any more than I am Booker. Now I have to find this, this Su Chong. And I don't even know who that is. Not yet. But you know he's the key, don't you? To what? You're asking me. Elizabeth. Are you? Huh? And how did you know exactly what to tell Atlas? Let me ask you a question. You feel like yourself, Elizabeth. I, I feel... I feel strange and 
smaller. I, I can't see the doors. What's behind the doors? I, I can't see the future. I can't even see any tears. Ugh. Oh my god. S stay away from me. Booker. No. No. No, please. Please don't. I died here. I was killed by that. Stay away from me! But then, how am I... Here, how can I be dead in this world and yet... My finger... What am I? Huh? I don't understand! I... I... If we're going to end up in the same place, we need some harm and enjoy the ride. Are you being cute? I've come round to your way of thinking. Have you? Yes. I do believe one can change things. But after all the bother, one often wishes that one had not. You're a fatalist. A physicist. A fatalist. So was Newton. Especially when it came to apples falling from trees. They always contrived to land with a splat. She left the child to rot. Are you implying she's the apple? I'm implying that she did not fall far from the tree. And now she wants to go back. I need to go back. To fix what I broke. Back to where she has no right to be. Back to where she doesn't belong. Doesn't belong? Wait, what do you mean? Do you want to tell her brother, or shall I? Because I died. There are rules. Even for one such as you. She'll forget. All the doors. And what's behind all the doors. All closed to her now. She'll be just like the rest of us. Forgetting the past. The present. The future. I'd wager she won't even remember this conversation. We've arrived. You're trading omniscience and croissants for death and mildew. I left Sally to rot. For what? So I could punish Comstock? He was trying to help her, to save her, and I... If I don't make that right... We all have our crosses to bear. But there is a thin line between a martyr and a fool. Lutesses warned me that if I came back here, I would collapse. Collapse? From a, a, a quantum superposition to just me. A uh, quantum what? I've changed, Booker. No tears, no cosmic knowledge. Just a normal girl. With a normal pinky. Peter, if, if I can't open tears, I, I'm never leaving here, am I? I'm never going back to Paris. You're... And you, you're just... You're, you're just what? You're, you're just the fragments of my memory telling me what my future holds? You decided to come here, Elizabeth. You knew what that meant. Only option as I see it is to trust yourself. Find Su Chong. to use this air grabber. It's gonna be messy, I don't know if... Well, a blow to the back of his head will serve just as well. Be a hell of a lot quieter, too. That's not what you would have done. I'm not Booker. Just because your father did something one way doesn't mean you have to. <laughs> You'll want to get the drop on him, and quiet. Shh. He's not getting up anytime soon. And what with his head all attached to his body? From here on, it's only gonna get worse. And how much worse is up to you? Children, a clay, Bradburn. It's up to us to see they become rational. Don't return to mud. Keep it down, Elizabeth. Come. Now, let's get his lockpick. It's a crossbow. Looks like the bolt delivers some kind of sleep agent. Probably fencyclidine or sodium thiopental. <laughs> they had all kinds of books in my tower. How do you think I always knew what ammo to toss you? No one. Ain't the same as being ready. 
Why don't you ask Comstock how ready I was? Your father's blood runs in your veins, but it doesn't have to be on your hands. I heard that. Pay attention, class. Uh, the oh, that only seems to be knocking them back. You're only gonna do real damage that way if they don't see you coming. Look, Su Chong, that's the name you had me tell Atlas. Huh. I don't follow. Looks like this character Su Chong has taken over the Silverfin restaurant. That's that's where the tear was that I used when I first came to Rapture looking for Comstock. Before this place was turned into a prison. But the first time you came to Rapture was in 1960, with Booker. When you drowned Song. Over a year from now. Yeah, that that that's right. I <laughs> When I could see all the doors, it all, it all made sense, but now, now it's, it's just a jumble. Elizabeth, you're bleeding. Now I know what it feels like. All right, if we're gonna find Su Chong, the Silverfin is the place to start. I know the way. I was here as well. Right after I came through, I needed... I needed something to wear that was a little more rapture appropriate. Every possible moment. And now... You're just like everyone else. Why? Why, because I died here? If I'm just like everyone else, I can't help Sally. I can't even get back to where I was. If you don't mind me asking, love, why are you talking to nobody? If I had pegged you for a loon, I might have had second thoughts on our arrangement. I'll hold up my end, but I better find the girl the way I left her. You're in no position to make demands. But I must confess, I do like a bit of sass in a lass. Someone must have shot him when he tried to break into Su Chong's. What's this? Hmm. Well, it seems like central heating came from this room, so it would stand to reason that the ductwork should go to Su Chong's. Wait a minute. Su Chong wasn't exactly a master of subterfuge. I think we found our man. No sign of him now. Either he's dead or working for Ryan. Columbia? He knew about Columbia. And, and Booker and, and me. The Suchong must have found a way to reopen the tear I made to come here. But how? A Lutest device. That's how he must have reopened the tear. Look, the tear still leads back to Columbia. Plasmids, Vigors. He and Fink must have been in communication, sharing secrets. Like the Lutestas before they were physically together. Why did I need to come here? What does this have to do with Sally? You remember, don't you? It hasn't happened yet? I told you, I can't do that. Concentrate, Elizabeth. No, the doors are shut. They're... Lutes particle. I use the Lutes particle. If, if it can make a city float... It can make a prison rise. I can't open tears, but we could use this device to go to Columbia and find a particle. But it's been vandalized. You'll fix it. Sure. You know, my tower didn't come stocked with the Lutest device repair manual. You will fix it. Yeah, I'll just... Elizabeth, you will fix it. Okay. Okay, there must be some information around here. Sodium, titanium. Why would these be on schematics for its code? 
A visionaire cipher. If if we assume hydrogen is A, and iron the 26th element is C. You always used to need a code key. Or... It's right here. Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. Looks like a punch list for things Su Chong needs to fix the machine. A cold cathode tube, a carbon dioxide scrubber, and a heat sink. Any of the vending machines should have the cathode tube. And we can look for a CO2 scrubber in the bathosphere showroom. A lot of models should have them. A heat sink. Oh, that's... We're in a department store. Are we gonna find... Keep your cool with old man winter. That'll work. Time to find those parts. And then I just have to repair the most sophisticated piece of technology ever created. Elizabeth, you saw yourself make this repair. You can do this. Whatever you say. Guess we better find our way out of here. Atlas, you there? I need a favor. A favor? I don't suppose you've conjured up the miracle you promised yet? I'm working on it. I'm gonna need some old man winter. You might try where they hawk them new bathospheres. As I hear it, old man winter's the only thing keeps their batteries from bursting into flames after five minutes. Thanks. Think nothing of it, but it's the last favor you'll be getting. for vandalism of Su Chung device is a death. Even for pretty lady. I suppose you'd be Su Chong. Save your ammunition, your device doesn't work. Device will work? Vandal sabotage! You are vandal! Actually, I intend to fix your device. That is, unless you plan on coming down here and doing it yourself. It's not prudent for Su Chong to return to lab. And you say you can fix it. I broke your code, didn't I? Now just give me the one to open that door, and we'll see what your creation can do. One, two, one, six. Your birthday? Enough of dog. Fix the machine. How'd you know that? Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. Once I find replacements for these parts, it's just be a matter of swapping them in for the broken ones. She said optimistically. Where there's bathospheres, there's bound to be CO2 scrubbers. And why is that? If you don't remove the carbon dioxide from the air supply in a submersible, it'll suffocate. One thing I did like about Rapture. Lots of new books to read. That will need a long haul bathosphere, something where the CO2 buildup would limit the submersible. Are you okay? I've seen all this happen before. I've seen everything. That will happen, and now. Now. I only see darkness. You sent yourself here for a reason. A debt. That's what you want to call it. This Atlas. I'm gonna have to kill him. Either that or he'll kill me. Maybe so. I'm not you, Booker. Some war hero. I'm not even me anymore. No tears, no omniscience, or whatever you want to call it. Just a whole lot of book learning. And a handful of lockpicks. Humpback whale. That thing is as old as the hills. Strictly bargain basement. You gotta wear an O2 tank and a mask. We won't find a scrubber on that. The ball in the house. Franklin. There. The stingray. Submersible time of 90 minutes. That's our girl. All the way up there. The grease monkeys had to get it up there somehow. Just gotta find the controls. When can I see you again? This is gonna be noisy. Ah, I ain't letting a good lead like that. Ah. Is that eager, you 
Remind me, why am I supposed to care? You see, me lads have taken a keen thirst for Adam. And there's a vintage right in front of me that'll do nicely. If you kill her, I truly hope you are happy living down here. Put down roots, raise a family. Or maybe you think Andrew Ryan is going to ride to your rescue. Fair enough. But remember, there are fast ways to harvest little sisters. And some very slow ones. Yeah? Atlas sent me here for some old man winter. You haven't been around here long, have you? What makes you say that? Because <laughs> eh, you're the only one of us who don't smell like the reptile house at the zoo. Now be quick about it, and just take the winter. This ain't the goodwill. Just what we needed. That was the last of it. Another coded message. Attempt to retrieve Ace in the hole from Su Chong unsuccessful. Ryan Private Security killed three of our men in the bargain. We'll need to explore alternate means of obtaining Ace. Well, not the perfect phosphor frequency, but it'll do. Stop it from overheating. There, everything's fixed. We're ready. Let's fire it up and see. What did I tell you? First Lady Mark II was built around a particle lift system just like all the buildings in the city. I read all about it in the Columbian Scientific. The particle seated at the top of the structure. Must be up that lift. Seems like a lot of technology just to float an airship. Comstock never heard of hydrogen. The First Lady Mark I did run on hydrogen, and it was destroyed by a single bullet from a Vox sniper. Unfortunately, the Prophet wasn't on board at the time. If I take the active particle, then the First Lady is just a 40-ton paperweight. Here we go. Now let's head back through that tear. You honestly expect Atlas to honor his side of the deal? No. But well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. How do you plan on handling Atlas? He ain't just some spliced-up maniac. He'll make a mistake. I just have to be ready to take advantage of it when it happens. All for a girl you barely know. How well did you know me when you came to Columbia? Nothing but trouble that way. Best to head straight back to Rapture. Pretty lady not finished yet. What? Open the tear! Power for device, very expensive. Need for that? Just tell me what you want. So John wanted something as simple. Lock of hair. Oh, you're not serious. Not your hair, stupid! Think Hodge's cigarette lap. Mothballed, forgotten. In there, hair sample. In jar. Cannot miss it. You get for Sutra. Then, everybody friends. Where is his lab? Closed off, past Fink's quarters. Um, you smart lady, you find. Should have seen. 
seen that one coming. Box Populi, we must have arrived right in the middle of the siege. That means the other you and I are probably inside the factory. On our way up to the First Lady. And what happens if we run into ourselves? We won't. How do you know that? Because we didn't. Taking your counsel. And you done me good service, but I will not hurt the boy. I will see Fink and Comstock burn, but I will not hold the son to account for the deeds of his father. You've misunderstood us. We neither asked you to harm the child. Nor did we promise that yours would be the hand that would set Comstock's world afire. A famous man once said. And a famous man shall say. I may reach the mountaintop. But I fear I shall never visit the valley below. But you mean I won't live to see the... No. It's up to you what matters more. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Someone is coming. She'll arrive a girl. She must leave a woman. And what makes the difference between a girl and a woman? Blood. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Turn her into a killer? How? Give the girl no choice. And she will be forced to make one. that thing you just picked up. My guess is that it has something to do with that giant clock out there. And that clock has something to do with opening the door to Fink's lab. A giant clock? Sort of. Looks like the mechanism unlocks certain activities when Fink gives his blessing. So what? We're stuck waiting for the cuckoo to go off? No. We've already found the clock key. We can manually wind it. Open whatever door we please. Idiot, his lock of hair. Listen, I got you your gun. I'm here for my ass. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Fox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. Are you there? I miss you. You were the only one who ever... You were my only friend. Booker. I'm not even here. I'm a projection of your own. Could you humor me then? Please. I think Booker would miss you. To what? A killer. Yeah, well, mission accomplished. I'm no martyr. How did you do it, Booker? How did you... Elizabeth, I'm not Booker. And neither am I. <sighs> huh. Seems like Fink and Su Chong were sharing their research. Like the Lutessas. Reality collaboration. It all makes a kind of sense. The little sisters and the big daddies. Songbird and me. Constants and variables. What's that? It's a skeletal formula for oxytocin. That's the chemical that bonds mothers to children, women to men, and... Songbirds to little girls. Apparently not. Fink dismissed it as an unsuitable vector. These poor things. Fink couldn't get them to imprint, so I left them to die.
Imprinting failed. I can't be right. Clearly they formed a connection between Songbird and me. Oh. I was so young, I... I always remember him just being there. It must be a prototype or something. Uh, is it human? Does it matter? Booker, the little girl in the film, it's me. My God. Oh, I, rem I remember he, he was, he, he'd crashed into the tower. I, I, I guess he was in some sort of fight. I waited there thinking, thinking, I, I don't know that something would happen, but, but he just lay there. Moaning. I couldn't just... The line with the thorn in its paw. So much for science. I should have just left him there to die. I should have just... I will never escape it. Exploited, exploiting, me, Comstock, you, Sally. It's like a wheel of blood spinning round and round. Well, this must be the genetic sample Su Chong wanted. He sent you all the way back here for a sample of your own hair? He doesn't know I was once the child that imprinted on Songbird. But to him, all the answers lie in DNA. Men like Su Chong mistake an ounce of empathy for a pound of science. It's open! See if anything's worth reappropriating. Check for stragglers. Spread out! Do you think Daisy really even had a choice? What do you mean? Right about now, I'm planting a pair of scissors in her back to protect a child she was never going to harm. But she chose to die for her revolution. What about me? For all the endless worlds, all the infinite possibilities, did I ever even have a choice? thought he did. <laughs> Look where it got us. Right back where we started. All these infinite universes. And yet we end up just going down the same paths. I don't take your meaning. My father sold me to settle a marker. Comstock locked me up in a tower. And I sold Sally for what? Revenge to prove a point? And yet, here you are, settling the debt. And say we find her. The old past their damage to the young. Isn't it too late for her now? Well, I'd say that's up to her to decide. Just as coming back here was up to you. Rapture runs on children. Little girls with gold growing in their bellies. I'm not gonna break any cycle. If I'm lucky, maybe I can dent it. Just a little. Pretty Lily has the hair. Deal is deal. Bring it to Su Chong. Pretty Lily put hair sample in tube. Then, business is finished. What's going on out there? Bloodshed, violence, but not relevant to our arrangement. Su Chong! Su Chong, we had a deal, now open! Do you know what they call someone who enters a man's home? Uninvited. A thief. And I do not remember inviting you into my city. I had a deal with Su Chong. Yi Su Chong is my employee. It was not a deal he was authorized to make. What do you want? I granted Atlas and his thugs asylum. 
You serve those same men in a desire to escape from my generosity. If they shall not have asylum, then they shall have liquidation. Give a parasite an ounce of charity. He'll demand a pound. I'm just looking for a girl that was taken from me. A little sister. I don't claim to understand what you are. But I know that you are special. There is business we can do together. And so, I give you a choice. Work for me, or die with Atlas. I'm not going anywhere without that girl. If it's a little sister you want, that shouldn't stand in the way of commerce. I've got dozens of them. I won't leave without her. My men stand ready to take down the door. In 60 seconds, they will enter the room. They will either treat you as a valued employee of Ryan Industries, or as a thief in the night. 60 seconds. There must be half a dozen of them or more. I've got to get ready. No traps. I, I can use the plasmids as traps and, and seed the room with them. i got to find somewhere to hide and, and surprise them. Take them down one by one. Forty seconds. You know what I see on your face? Uncertainty. Who is this girl to you? Thirty seconds. Do you know the value of the shark? Without them, the sea would be littered with the detritus of the weak. The men who come for you have much in common with those great animals. What sharks do for the ocean, these men do for rapture. Twenty seconds. I will tell you something you already sense. Atlas does not honor agreements. And Orion does. I cannot save your Sally, but I can save you. Targets, you get me? Stupid jerk. Should have never. Ah. I beat your sharks, Ryan. The better man won. Isn't that the only thing you respect? Now let me the hell out of here. What's your plan? I can't just place the particle on the ceiling, it would just tear right through it. But every building in Rapture was submerged into the ocean on a lunette ring, connected to the junction of its load-bearing supports. That's fascinating and all, but if you haven't noticed, Ryan sent his goons to murder us. If you're gonna pull a rabbit out of a hat, now's the time to do it. Looks like the structural junction is in Frank Fontaine's office. If I can get there, I can float the building. It so happens I've taken that bastard's office for my own use. I'll make sure you've access to the private elevator. Now hurry. Come on, where do you get off? There's supposed to be a brunette. Anyone see? What's going on? Ryan said to erase you! Ran off? No skin off my nose. Elizabeth, you know Atlas is going to... I know. And I'm ready. Are you sure? I sent myself here for a reason. Didn't I? And who exactly are you speaking to, Miss Comstock? If I were less acquainted with the vicissitudes of genius, I suspect I would question your sanity. I know so little of you, but I imagine the more I learned, 
the more exceptional I will find you. You know Atlas will betray you. And what are you? My best friend? You're one of a kind in this world. Or others. And now, your misguided sense of altruism sends you to your doom. It's like watching Isaac Newton die in a house fire. A vain attempt to save his cat. There, there, there. All the load-bearing columns come into this room and they meet... They meet there. I just need to place the particle in that junction, activate it, and the whole structure should rise. Kashmir's all on the hill. If Ryan didn't know we were back before, I'm sure now he's got the message. What do you want with this one? If anybody's got the line on the ace, it's her. Find out what she knows. But no quackery. She's no good to us with a halo and a set of wings. I can start it as soon as the chloroform wears off. Don't see her as too tough a nut. What? What? Where's the ace in the hole? I don't... I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we had a deal. Where I... is the ace in the hole? I told you. I told Sodium did... salpentol. Are you familiar? <clears throat> no. Truth serum. Unpredictable stuff. <sighs> To little nothing. I have to nothing much. to tell the you. I don't even know enough. what an ace in the hole is. Ah! I am still playing ah! with the dosage. This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made, and men who make it. deal was to get you out of prison. What, did you expect me to win your war for you too? I'd tend to your own knitting if I were you. 
Now, darling, being that you were Su Chong's lab assistant and all, why not tell me where me ace in the hole went to? I don't know. Buddy. As I said, I'm no doctor. But that doesn't mean I don't find the field fascinating. I keep up on all the medical journals and the like. I hope you have someone to help you with all the big words. You know what part of the brain free will comes from? Stubbornness? The prefrontal lobe. Now, I think it's fair to say you're a bit of a stubborn one, are you not? A man named Steinman taught me this. He's a bit of a lunatic, but a fine surgeon. He calls this little trick a transorbital lobotomy. Take hold of her, lads. You're wasting your now, time. If you won't remain still, I can't be held responsible for what comes next. Here we go. You feel that? I'm moving the pick across your eyeball. Oh, still now. And resting it on your skull. There's about a bit over a quarter of an inch of bone between the pick and your prefrontal lobe. And that's where this little fella comes in. I don't... Shh, 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 shh. It was just a wee tap. But I don't expect it'll take more than a few of those to reach the meat. And then we might find you a bit less the mule. Where's me ace in the hole? I don't know. You know right. what else rests in the lobe? Creativity. Individuality. Personality. In short, what makes you, you. I'm just about through now. Last chance, pet. Where is the ace in the hole? <laughs> or what? What, you'll put a hole in my head and take away my memories? You want to make me forget all this? You want to make me not care anymore? Go ahead. You'll be doing me a favor. Oh! <laughs> Bring in the monster! You're a regular hero, ain't you? Can't risk ripping the only part of you that's worth a damn. Well, there's more than one way to fry an egg. Now, little one, are you familiar with the term transorbital lobotomy? Please let her it's go. It's a simple matter. All I need to is insert this pick into please, your eye. Please, I don't know and anything. Give a few I... taps with me. Hand. I don't know anything. Better to show by example. Please, please don't. I, I don't know anything. I, I don't know. Please. Tell him what I don't know. Where are we? You saw all the doors. And what's behind all the doors. The ace in the hole. It's here. Yes. But, but I don't... I don't remember this place. You've never been here. Then how would it... The memories you lost, they weren't just of the past. You saw behind all the doors. Even the ones into the future. I'm going. If you want. I... I don't like it here. It's a bad place. He's never gonna let me go, is he? Even if I bring him the ace. Then why am I here? How if I was so smart? If I saw so much, why just send myself to the slaughter? For Sally. No, one day he will just rip her open and tear out her atom. All of this for nothing. Why did I do it? Why? You have to decide. Decide what? To take a leap of faith. I can't tell you what you were thinking because you don't remember. But you chose to come. There. In that room. The Ace. I don't know what to do, Booker. I... B Booker? Booker! No, please. Please just don't leave me here!
Su Chong's clinic. It's at Su Chong's clinic. That's a bit convenient now. Ryan's got every turret in the place tuned to me and me man's genetic code. We'd be torn to shreds before we got ten feet. That's right. Which is why I'm gonna do it for you. You okay with that? Get me the ace. I'll wrap the brat in a silk ribbon. Bag her and bring her to my bathosphere. <sighs> One of the lads will show you how to get inside. We'll be waiting for you where you come out. Shake a leg now. The Lord hates a laggard. Somebody to, to, to figure out how to fix it. I, maybe there's some. I don't know. Is there some documentation for him around here or something? Right. Look who I'm asking. Daddy will not imprint. If not imprint, what good is he to little sister? She no like him. He no like her. The situation is impasse. Unacceptable. If stupid beasts had half brain, they would realize they need little sister to live. Sisters secrete only kind of atom that is genetic match for them. No little sister, no big daddy. Scary, 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 scary. I've got to do something. Big monster sick. Big monster it's okay. Sick. It's it's okay. Please. I, I don't know how to help him. He needs Adam. I, I don't have any of that. I, I don't know what to do. Going to die. Not fair. We can help. Genetic sequence to uh, sequence to allow for get away, you filthy little shit! What? What are you doing? Get back! Get back!
Así es. This is it. This is the ace in the hole. All the pain and all of the death for this. Sister, over here. Do you have it? I have it. Give it over then. I'm keen to get this brat off me hands. You know what? Andrew Ryan said I was a rube. But he was wrong. I'm not the Rube, Atlas. You are. <laughs> we both know what happens next. Just get it over with. Well, love, if you insist. What is this? It's just a bunch of gibberish. What, what does, does this say, you little whore? Hey, hey, hey! What does this say? We've got the activation phrase. Now all we've got to do is get that genetic freak of nature on an airplane and rapture's ours. Save the world entire. It is you who are the safe. I can see all the doors. And what's behind all the doors? And behind one of them. Incredibly, I see him. Sa, 